That is a good crappie. Wow. Another nice crappie here at Kachuma Lake. He will be our lunch today. Yes. <laughs> Hook to cook. Nice. Look at that crappie. So we're gonna go ahead and have, we have fresh crappie tacos and pico, some guac and a little lemon juice. <laughs> and there is the final product. The flavors just pop. Mm. Yep, nice little kachuma, kachuma rainbow trout. Awesome. Oh, Are you here? <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> Come on, keep it up. Release the hound. Oh, he's released. The hound is re what the? Oh my goodness. The hound has been compromised. <laughs> So that's the horrible thing. I have no concealer, no foundation, just bronzer and highlighter. Gosh, that's terrible, honey. I know. You First catch world way problem. more fish when you have makeup. I know. That's what brings the fish in. We are going to catch a whole lot of trout. I'm super excited because we need to fill the fridge. So I have to catch my limit. Do you know when they filled it last? Yeah, they stocked about a month ago now, so there's quite a few. But we're gonna meet up with Henry, and he's the person who runs the bait shop out there at Kachuma Lake. And he's invited Veronica and I and Dexter to fish on a pontoon boat with him and Easter, his, uh, his lady. So, should be a fun trip. We're on our way right now. We're running a little bit late. Honey? Wasn't it my fault? It's never my fault. We'll see how we do. Veronica's right, we have a freezer that is barren of trout right now, so we need to have nicely vacuum sealed pieces of trout that we can have for dinner over the next few weeks. So we'll catch you when we get to the lake. I want to see what I look like when I'm on the... Okay, I look okay at least. I mean, can't help the dark circles, they just don't... It's okay, better than nothing. Finally have my eyebrows in. Okay. Wow. <laughs> wow. What? Uh-oh. Oh no. Wow. What is going on? Boo. That sucks. Look at the line. Boom. What are we doing? We are waiting in line because it's the weekend. During the weekdays, it's definitely not as busy and that's usually when I have my days off, which is awesome. So usually when I come on the weekdays, I'm almost certainly one of the only boats on the water, which is super nice. Your uh, beard looks pretty on point. Thank you, thank you. What is all of this? So you guys are in for a real treat. You are about to meet Henry. He is the manager of the bait and tackle store here uh, on Kachuma. And guys, this video is gonna be kind of a fishing report on the lake levels. Uh, Henry's gonna tell us about that. He's also going to uh, tell us about uh, conditions, how it's been, what lures have been working. So you guys are in for a real treat and he's gonna give us a tour of the bait and tackle shop just to show us well, what they've got and then also he's gonna touch on uh, the boat rental program looks like he is working he's got his hands busy right now but let's just get a quick look at this lake right now it's looking super high compared to where we saw it last so this is so exciting guys wow it is all the way up there was people in line 
and you want six worms. What would you like? Regular, wow. garlic, glow. So we'll, we'll have all our boats rented today and have a waiting list. Wow. Which is a great, this is, the, this is like a summer business day. This is awesome. It's a lot busier than we thought it was going to be uh, while planning this, but we will fish on. Well, you're in flip -flops. Aren't your toes cold? <laughs> yeah, my toes are extremely cold. True Filipino status. Ye so there is Edward with his Yeti gear. Super heavy, so we're going to actually take the boat from where we're at to the dock right there. So that way we don't have to carry it down the stairs. We've got tacos on the menu today. Trout tacos. Have not been out on Kachuma Lake in like six months-ish. But looking forward to it. Let's see, we'll go meet up with Daxter and Edward in a minute. Here you are! So how do I get in that boat? <laughs> Come on, buddy. <laughs> there you go. Say hi. All right, hop on. Yep, that's Mukwa. Say hi. You have a buddy. I'm Dexter. Oh, what a beautiful morning, huh? I mean, it's just, it's so awesome. Yeah, and it's crazy. Two months ago, th this was just packed with trailers and shore fishermen. Yeah, we used to go launch off of that area. Can't even see it anymore. <laughs> By a good amount, too. You're talking yeah. easily 15 feet underwater. So the main launch ramp hasn't been used since 2012. This and one right it, it opened up last weekend and much fanfare. And it's just it's so much easier to unload your boat. And it's just, it's, it's great. You know, ever since the main launch ramp opened up, daily boat traffic has, has easily doubled in, in the last week. So get down here, guys. We had a 4,000 uh, pound plant of Lassen trout a month ago, and it, wow. the fishing is fishing is great. Yeah, there's some trophies in there, guys. <laughs> there's, uh, yep. I, I heard there's eight pounders in there. A uh, gentleman on uh, Wednesday caught a uh, uh, seven and three quarter pound, brought it up, got it scaled and pictured. Wow. And a gentleman caught a 10 pounder took his picture with it and then released it back in. So there is a 10 pound monster out there. <laughs> if we can get a really good rain next Tuesday, Wednesday, um, pretty much everybody thinks we'll be full wow. within a week from the, the runoff. We're still raising about a half of a foot every day just from runoff still. Wow. So it's, uh, it's, it's really good. We just topped 75% this morning. Yeah, give me some. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> and thank you for taking us out. No, thank you. Because I got to pick your brains. Oh, yeah. I, I, I've learned how to fillet from your videos. Stop. Stop. Learned how to make fish Stop. tacos from your videos. <laughs> we'll have some fish tacos later today. You think we might be able to get some crappie on camera today? We, we might. It's, I think it's still a little too cold for them. But when people have caught a crappie, they've been pretty big. So yeah. if we get a crappie, I'd say we got about a 75% chance it's going to be a pound and a half or more. It'll be a, it could be a great day. Show us what we're using. Tell us the game plan. Well, we got a jointed Rapala. It's a size J7 Fire Tiger pattern. Really productive when the trout are top water. Uh, the colors. Um, more visible uh, colors with the red and yellow are more visible in the uh, top column uh, uh, spectrum from light which is why you go lighter colors when it's uh, top water and darker colors when it's uh, when you're going deeper and I've got a quarter ounce weight on here and gonna try to run this through between six to eight feet and see what we can do and what do you got on there honey I've got a Quarter ounce, Castmaster? What color, gold or silver? Silver. I've got a silver one. Yes. I heard that drag being pulled. I know. This time has been just about figuring them out, so we're gonna figure them out though. That's the challenge, and that's why we love this sport too, because you always have to figure something new out in order to get them. They don't always stay the same. It's not always the one bait always works. 
I'm up for the challenge. Are you guys up for the challenge? You're up for the challenge. Up for the challenge. Puppies, you guys up for the challenge? You guys gonna see some fish? <laughs> so built up along the coast. Oh yeah. Oh, got him? Oh. Nice. Henry is on the board. He thought he snagged something at first. Probably a crappie. <laughs> Probably a big crappie. Oh, skating him in. Oh, it is a crappie. Nice. Yeah, big crappie. Ooh, crappie tacos. Yeah, some fresh crappie with our lunch today. Yeah, that is a <laughs> nice one. Look at that. Big wide body skating in. There we go. Oh, that is a good crappie. Wow. That is a really good crappie. Whoa. Massive. Nice. That thing is massive. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my goodness. Double hooked him with the troubles too. He's yeah. He went after that guy. <laughs> that is the biggest mouth I've seen on a crappie ever. <laughs> Another nice crappie here at Kachuma Lake. He will be our lunch today. Yes. <laughs> Hook to cook. Oh! Oh yeah, that's a fish. That's a fish. Oh, that is a good crappie. Wow. Wow. I'm okay to keep on doing this all day. <laughs> I mean, big crappie. Look at, look, like this rod is a medium heavy. I can't gain on him. <laughs> I can't gain on this guy. Oh my gosh, he's skating the surface. He's so big. <laughs> this is a this is the big crappie. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he felt like a log. I was just telling Henry that I yeah, I would I would be happy to catch a bunch of these today. I asked you earlier too, you think we're gonna see some crappie today? Oh my gosh, he's tiring. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> oh, nice. That's that. Uh, nice, nice. Look at that crappie. Wow. That's a Kachuma Lake crappie right there. That's what, you, that's what you start getting used to if you can. That is a nice one. That'll make a couple tacos. Pointer XD right there. American Shad pattern. Awesome. Yeah, so this lure runs about 11 feet. Oh, nice. It's got a nice long bill, tight wobble. Henry's showing us how it's done. That's a trap. Yeah, a little bit farther out. A little baby trout. A little baby trout. Uh -oh. little baby trout, gonna live. Live. live to fight another day? Yeah, live to fight another day. Get bigger. Got him on the fire, Tiger. <laughs> yeah, little little guy. Alright, get bigger. <laughs> oh, got one. Got one. Oh wait, that was missed. <laughs> what? <laughs> you were recording? That's great. Take two. Take two. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> First keeper of the day here at Lake Kachuma Yay. with Henry. 
It's a good one. Yep, nice. So the bite is definitely heating up. I think on this last pass and a half, we've already gotten two really good crappie. And we've got two trout. Uh, one, one was uh, keeper size, so we're excited. It's definitely heating up. So, and literally, literally and figuratively, because the sun is out and it's nice and warm. It's a beautiful day. Henry was just saying that, uh, what, the beaches are probably packed right now? Beaches are probably packed, but they're not having half as much fun as we are. <laughs> Unless, of course, the surf perch bite is on. Picking up Easter. He, oh my as goodness. soon as we left, he like jumped on the seat and came to sit with me. <laughs> oh, I know. I know, buddy. I know. Boy. So Easter joined us. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> yes. Yep, some canoers. Yeah. Nice. That's nice. Guacamole, pico de gallo, cabbage, and butter. And then we got the tortillas. So. Fire is on. I cut off a piece of this butter. Good call. This is all the crappie meat. About to make some crappie taco. Oh yeah, that's good. Using the uh, asada seasoning. It's enough to give it some color. The tortillas going on. So we're gonna go ahead and have, we have fresh crappie tacos. You season them up with the um, carne asada seasoning, seasoning yeah. butter, and then we warmed up some tortillas, and we have some cabbage and you, pico, sir? some guac yes. and a little lemon juice. <laughs> and there is the final product. That smells really great. Fresh caught crappie tacos. Mm. Wow. Flavors just pop. Mm. It's good? Mm -hmm. So good. Very good. <laughs> Juicy. That good flavor. It absorbed that seasoning well. It did. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. It's really cool to be able to be out on the water, still be able to catch fish while you eat something freshly cooked like a hot meal like normally when you go fishing you're eating a, a tuna sandwich or peanut butter and jelly or i don't know ham and cheese or something that's cold but to have something hot and fresh and delicious that's next level henry is on oh i want it <laughs> that'd be great if it's another crappie <laughs> That's our third crappie. Two trout. Although he hasn't started skimming yet, it might be a trout. Wow, that'd be amazing. This spot is usually out of the water. <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh, did we bring up the net? Oh, that is crap. Oh, that's a good crap. Yeah. 
definitely getting up. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's a great crowd. Nice. Yes. Awesome. I'm gonna have to tie one of those on. <laughs> yeah, the J, the J7 Fire Tiger, working its magic. A little top water action at Kachuma. <laughs> I am done cooking. <laughs> Oh, it's a crappie. Oh, nice. It's a good crappie. There you go. That's what you wanted. Oh. Easter's on him. <laughs> He's got some meat on him. All right. What oh, are yeah. What do you do here? Sling him up? Yep. Sling him up. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here you go, Easter. You get to. Awesome. <laughs> That's how you hook the okay. cook right there. Yeah. We're going with a small presentation. Wow, oh, this thing's lost a lot of line. Yeah, the um, the guys that I got this wine from. Oh, got one. Really? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Okay, so. I felt the nibble. Just cast it out. I literally just cast it out. Wow. On that tiny cast master, 16th ounce. Well, I figure because you guys are catching them kind of high in the water column uh, in terms of crappie, so I'm okay with that. <laughs> Give that a shot. Only thing is, I'm using really light line with this. I think I have six pound test on this. Is it a trout? Uh, it might be a crappie. It's not running like a trout. I have a feeling it's a crappie. I just can't skate them in. No, that's a trout. Oh, it's a trout. That's a trout. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, that's a good one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I know. Down the line. Uh, all right. Oh no, he's... He's too small. Aww. Yes! He's a good size. He's a good size. Yeah. He's got a black tag. Is that a black tag? No, this is a, a zip tie that oh, came off. a black tag on him though. Might be blue. Is it a holdover? Oh, it's green. Oh, it's a green tag. It's a green tag. Yeah. All right. I think blues were... Kachuma Lake. November, December. Switch to this. Switch to that? I switched to this small cast master, a little gold, one sixteenth ounce yeah. <laughs> cast master. Tempted this little guy into biting. All right. Well, that was awesome. Was like a two second cast for you. Yeah. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> I think that small. It has something to do with that smaller profile. But it's just one fish, so you can't like. You can't say it's a pattern when it was just one fish. You know, it's it's got to be two or more. I think three or four would be a solid pattern. Like, okay, we've dialed them in. We know the depth. This is exactly how to catch them. But if you just get one, yeah, we'll see. We'll see if lightning can strike twice. Little That's a trout, trout, Easter. <laughs> are you little? Are you just a little baby? <laughs> oh, you are. Oh, yeah. So we I were don't just. Even think that's a trout. What is that? That's oh, a that's bass. a bass. That's a bass. Not a bass. Oh, I've seen him smaller, but now we'll throw him back, won't we? Yeah. <laughs> nice. No, it's all because I needed to relieve myself. <laughs> we got this outhouse right here, and uh, nature calls. So I'm gonna go uh, spare you the details, but you know. Right. And then Easter caught a bass. All right, we'll catch you in a little bit once I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> so Henry and I were just eating and enjoying our burgers <laughs> and this trout had to come and mess everything up. <laughs> All of a sudden he's like taking a bite and he's like, I'm on, I'm on. Yeah. Go, put a nice little 
Don't fight on. Another one under Apollo. This one's just the plane, you know, the, the F, F3. No, um, so he's, he's near the surface. Oh no, it's probably, right? When they submarine at the end, when they skip. Oh no. It's a trout, yeah. That's a good trout. A good trout? Oh, oh wow, yeah. that is a good trout. Wow. Oh. It's a red tag too. Awesome. Wow. Look at that. Yep, nice little Kachuma, Kachuma rainbow trout. Awesome. Oh, I'm on. Are you in? Yeah. Wow. I am. This is great. Woo. Come on, keep it up. Ugh. Fire tiger, the fire tiger, the fire tiger pattern is mm -hmm. killing them. There he is. Just oh. watch it. There you go. Nice. Oh, he got oh. off. I think he got caught on he the boat. He did. He did. He did. Oh, I saw him. I didn't get him out and crossed the side enough. Oh, oh, so sad. We'll get him. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> get back in there. Hey, I, w I wasn't cursing this time. <laughs> I have done that before. <laughs> We're trying to keep this show family friendly. I know, I know. <laughs> so yeah, already off the water, it is 5.06. Henry's gonna show me the bait and tackle shop because Earlier when we came by, it was super busy. There was like a line of six or seven people. It was pretty wild. So this is uh, this is the bait and tackle shop here. This is Big Jake. What's and, uh, up? This is Autumn. Hi, Autumn. Providing superior guest service to, to the customer and um, sell a, 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 a mixture of hooks, sinkers, weights. We've got uh, flicker shads, rapalas, panther martins, needlefish. Power bait, night crawlers, macro for the catfish. So pretty nice. You got a couple of different uh, nets. Uh, so pretty good, pretty good sample. Uh, we open at currently we open at 7 a.m. Close at 5:30. Boats have to be in at 4:30. We'll be going pretty soon to 6:30 to six probably. The summer hours. Yeah, probably summer hours. All in all, it's a uh, it's a uh, you know Rocky Mountain Recreation does a good job providing. You know the, the local area with the boats and the fishing uh, knowledge to go out and have a good day, nice. like we had. Yeah, we had a good day. <laughs> we definitely had a good day. Whoa! I just noticed this thing. I know. I was gonna say there's a lizard. Whoa. There's a lizard and it's alive. <laughs> That's Lucy. Lucy the lizard. Wow. Is that yours? Well, now it is. <laughs> what does that even mean? It was his, but now it's mine. Oh. <laughs> he gave it to me. Oh. Lucy, got a new, got a new, uh, new master. <laughs> Having her salad. <laughs> uh, you guys should definitely come out to Kachuma. Record highs. I mean, after having such a, a drought, 2012 and, and onward, all the way 16 was the worst, I guess, right? Yeah. For it to rebound like this is amazing. You guys should definitely check it out. Rent your kayaks, rent your boats. Come on out. Thanks. We'll catch you later. And um, do you want any more wine? I was like a little bit. And so they, um, yeah, they made them an outside sink and everything there. I still have a little bit, but oh, nice. More. But yeah, they. Um, so they you guys are getting along. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> We're both so we both like fishing and we both like wine. I don't even know how much. Can't beat it. He's like, whoa. <laughs>